का सिनेमा जिस तरह की होते हैं जो भी सिनेमा है चल रही है सामाजिक सरोकार पे केंद्रित रहती है जितने भी पुराने दौर के सिनेमा हैं जी वो आज भी हमारे रायपुर में एक ऐसे संस्थान है जो सरोकार का थोड़ा सिनेमा माइक थोड़ा थोड़ा। जो सरोकार का सिनेमा चालू किया हुआ है जी। और महीने में एक बार ऐसी मूवी दिखाया जाता है जो सामाजिक की सारी दृश्यों को केंद्रित करता है सोशल सब्जेक्ट जी तो वो से एक पर्टिकुलर दर्शक बनते जा रहे हैं मतलब उनका एक मोटो है कि दर्शकों को बांधना पुराने दौर की फिल्मों को लाकर जो सामाजिक समस्याएं हैं तो इस तरह के क्या आपको लगता है कि चैनलों में भी इस तरह के कार्यक्रम लगातार होने चाहिए अगर वो हुआ तो बहुत कमाल कमाल हो जाएगा लेकिन हम तो यही मैं सिंपली बोल रहा हूँ कि ये फॉगॉटन क्लासिक्स है और हमारा एक ड्यूटी बनता है कि शो इट टू द नेक्स्ट जनरेशन सिंपल फिर आगे जो होता है वो अलग बात है बट वाई कीप इट इन द कबर्ड कोई अच्छी चीज हमारे आपके कबर्ड में एक अच्छा खासा सूट हो तो आप निकाल के पहनेंगे क्यों नहीं सिंपल इज दैट फिर बोलेंगे ये नया स्टाइल बनाओ ऐसे ही सूट पहनते जाओ इट्स इट्स देर एटलीस्ट दिखाओ सबको कि ये जमाने में ऐसे सूट बना, बना करते थे यू नो आई आई थिंक इट्स वी आर नॉट हेयर टू चेंज एनीथिंग वी जस्ट पुलिंग आउट फॉर वॉट इज फॉर एंड प्रेजेंटिंग इट टू द न्यू जनरेशन एंड टू मी एंड टू माई जनरेशन एंड टू माई टू माई मदर हु इंजॉय वॉचिंग इट वाई नॉट है ना Hi, Baban. Hi. Uh, this is Pooja Samantia. Hi, Pooja. Thanks Hi. for smiling so wide from there. Yeah. Thank you so much. Uh, wanted to know from you, the, um, which are the films of Bimal Roy that really made impact on your life? How the films were so influential, and how they are relevant even in today's era? Absolutely. The, as I mentioned, I, uh, all Bimal Roy films are great. You know, you can't be you know selective. But the one that impacted me, as I said in the earlier thing, was Do Bhiga Zameen. and more it was a tragedy of sorts he goes back he works to get his land back and let me give you a piece of trivia that the ending of the film was very different from the one which has been released the film was that his wife paro again nirupa roy uh, he gets his land back he goes he works as a rickshaw up makes the money he gets his land back paro dies ye earlier uh, Nirupa Roy dies. He loses his wife, and the audience has cried and cried and cried earlier. Me, or very tragic. Ho gaya. So they decided to change the ending. Paro lives. Nirupa Roy lives. So he gets his love, but when he goes to get back his land, the land has a factory on it. So even if he wanted, he could not get his land back, which is also a tragedy. but it was a wonderful statement about the industrialization of india of those times this is what is going to happen and how does one cope with it but to bimal roy decided to keep nirupa alive so that at least he's got love in his life and then there is hope without hope there is nothing so this actually must have moved me in a big way and also as i said it moved me and influenced me as an actor and i called during the research of this i called up mr parikshit sahani and i said i'm watching do bhiga zameen and we are presenting it and he was so happy and such a wonderful person he always calls everybody brother brother very happy bro brother very good and i said up up uh, give me some experiences as you may have had as a child with your father and he was so candid and so honest that <coughs> beg your <laughs> beg your pardon that when balraj ji went to meet this is a story of hope let me tell you this is a story of hope when balraj ji went to meet bimalda i think rishikesh mukherji sahab said that he's done one film have a look at this actor a uh, balraj ji was english speaking came from england had done law suited booted he put powder on his face it's in his biography too he put powder on his face and went to meet bimalda bimalda without even making him say one word he said bye bye thank you nahi chahiye so so he is a is pretty decent actor he says nahi 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 this is a rickshaw wala this is a farmer he has to run on the streets of kolkata with a rickshaw in his hand there will be no special effects i want somebody who looks rugged and indian and balraj ji got very upset ki yaar ye right hai main suit boot pehen ke gaya main english mein baat karne laga main england return tha highly educated he went back changed his clothes went back and did an audition and according to parikshit ji that the audition was very bad because he felt that dad did not know how to act socho balraj ji by his own admission said he did not know how to act 
So he went back again and he read all great books on acting. He read Konstantin Stanislavski's Actor Prepares. He read and read and read and read and he put it into practice. And he says for months he would, he would get into the character, wear those clothes, walk in a particular way. And in my opinion, he's one of India's first great method actors. And he's saying, no one was with him, so they would take him to his mom and sit in the rickshaw. And he used to run around Kolkata for hours till his, the webbing of his feet used to crack. So even if people turn around and tell you, you are not a good actor, you can work and become a good actor. And he says, I used to get, I used to, I used to freeze before facing the camera. Balraj Ji has said this, I am saying it. And then you see what he's gone and done. So this is the great, great relevance. And I spoke to you about uh, Dobhi Ghazameen and the industrialization and the plight of the farmer. I think these movies are way ahead of their time. And it is very important, sir, that we see these movies today for these things. Some young actor will see Balraj Ji and feel so very enthused like I was. Like I was. And, and let me tell you, sometimes I'm ashamed when I say, in, in many places, I say, they ask me, who's your favorite actor? And I say, Balraj Sani. And the people look at each other. Who? Sorry. It hurts me. It pains me. This is our national treasure. And the young generation doesn't know. And no, no, young generation. Sometimes even the 40-year-old the, the and the 50-year-old doesn't know who Balraj Sani is. I think shame on us. Shame on us. Uh, Hello, sir. Uh, this I, is Jayanti from uh, Jayanti? Zicho Vistas. Zicho Jayanti. Jayanti. Yeah. Hi, Jayanti. Thanks for smiling. <laughs> you, thank you. Okay. Uh, you said that uh, Bimal Roy is a legendary director and you are inspired by yourself. But in the past, who are the directors of today's time that you are very proud of or very inspired? Who are the Bimal Roy in your opinion? That's an unfair thing to say, Jayanti. Aajke zamane ke Bimal Roy is not a good thing to say because each director, a director is a person who does not take a script and put it on the screen. A director is a person who takes a script, makes it his own and says what he wants through the story. Story is one place, the story is the one thing that the director wants to say, that is the most important thing. So each director has his own way, his own visual style, his own acting style, his own uh, edit style. So that's a little unfair. But yes, I will say there are, there are two or three directors today that I am extremely, extremely impressed with because he, they make socially relevant films and make them entertaining. Vimalda also, he made socially relevant films, controversial films, and people accepted it and made them relevant and made them entertaining. I said that an esoteric film was made in festivals and it didn't come to understand anyone. The public related to these films in films. Similarly, I feel Rajkumar Hirani does that for us today. He does that today. He makes relevant subjects like, like education. He makes relevant subjects like just humanity on, and kindness in the medical profession. I mean, it's absolutely uh, uh, stunning and make them so highly entertaining. So, if at all, and then of course, uh, my, my new favorite director, Shudit uh, Sarkar, I, I, I'm so... Uh, happy in the way, uh, the kind of cinema he's appro approaching and making and making it successful. That's great. I mean, Piku was my favorite film of last year. I don't know if you agree with me. I just love that film because, yes, again, there is a Piku, there's a story. This is their story. And under the story, there are two or three things that are unsaid. They go to the house and then we feel like we get hooked to the story and we keep saying, he's talking about life. He's talking about caring, he's talking about different people, he's talking about another kind of love, he's talking about death in another way, relating it to your stomach problems. What are the connections with him? I feel, I feel it is a, it is a, it is a great voice. Bimalda was a great voice in his time, Gurudat was a great voice in, of his time. And I feel these, these gentlemen have something, absolutely something. We'll take one more question and then Baman will be okay. with you uh, for Baman the group said, interactions. Please, please, no problem. Yeah. Uh, Sorry if my voice is sounding tired, I'm really unwell, but I'm trying very hard to... <coughs> Sorry, sir. <coughs> Sorry, sir. Koshish Shah. Hi, Koshish. Thank you for smiling. Hello. Hi. ये ये जो जरिया है जो ये क्लासिक दिखाने का बाय टीवी टीवी माध्यम से इसके अलावा भी ये क्लासिक को जीवन रखने के लिए और कोई जरिया है कि 
और भी आ, कोई आपके हिसाब से लग रहा है ये तो अच्छा ही जरिया है राइट right. बट आपके हिसाब से और कोई जरिया है कि जो क्लासिक को और भी हम लोग किसी और भी जरिए से दिखा सके अनफॉर्चुनेटली आज तो फिल्म तो उन लोग फोन पे भी बेच रहे हाउ कैन यू वॉच अ क्लासिक फिल्म ऑन अ फोन आई एम सॉरी बट इफ दिस इज अ ट्रेंड आई एम नॉट सेंग वी गॉट टू मेक इट अ ट्रेंड ट्रेंड इज अ बैड वर्ड ये दिखा है तो लोग ये पांच फिल्म के अलावा उनके सब सारे फिल्म देखेंगे दे गेट एक्साइटेड टू सी द नेक्स्ट ऑफ द सीरीज आप फॉरेन में जाएंगे लोग बिमल रॉय की फिल्म देखते हैं आज भी आई नो ऑफ अमेरिकन गर्ल हु डज नॉट नो टू स्पीक इन हिंदी हैज सीन एवरी सिंगल हिंदी मूवी दैट मैटर फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट साइलेंट इरा टिल टूडे सो यू स्टार्ट एन एक्साइटमेंट इन अ पर्सन की ये भी देखने लायक है ये फिल्म एंड वेद जो आप मीडियम बोल रहे हैं ना जहां पे दिखाएंगे कहां पे दिखाएंगे या तो सिनेमा में दिखाएंगे लेकिन सिनेमा में हमारे पास इतने सारे स्क्रीन स्क्रीन है लेकिन वो भी स्क्रीन कम पड़ रहे सो लेट्स कीप दैट असाइड दूसरी कहां जगह डीवीडी डीवीडीज पे हम लोग बेच सकते हैं लेकिन डीवीडी में लेने वाला कौन है जब तक हम यहां पर थोड़ा इन द हाउस इन द फेस दिखा दे फिर इवन दैट कैन कंटिन्यू ये भी बहुत बड़ी बात है आई फील एंड मोर चैनल शुड पिक इट अप एवरी चैनल शुड है क्लासिक चैनल in hollywood all all uh, all great studios have their classic channel it's their treasure boss it is their treasure and they are proud of it so i don't know with other mediums uh, where do we show movies we can have festivals but this is a a great idea i feel discussions ho sakte fir film uh, bimal roy festival on on uh, in theaters bhi kar sakte we'll come to that later okay. the road has just the, the journey has just started okay. so